My name is Roland from netbooknews.com and .de and today we have another Samsung netbook which this time is the NB30. It's kind of a business version of the N150, one of the new Atom Pineview net netbooks with an Intel Atom N450 processor. And let's take a look. It's got the usual specs that you know from the new Pine, Pine Trail or Pineview netbooks. The only difference is it doesn't have one of those 250 gig hard drives, it only has a 160 gig hard drive. Let's check it out. This is the accessory box, the other one, the other part is as usual the netbook itself. And we're gonna put the device itself aside for a second and let's check out the accessory box. Shouldn't look too different from the N150, but Oh, you have a sleeve in here. You didn't get one with the 150. Looks like a typical Chinese made cheap sleeve for your netbook, which should be all right to just fend off some bumps and everything. Pretty good. Here we have environment certificates. What else? The installation guide, warning information, and the safety instructions. All right, what else is in the box? This is the battery, which has 11.1 volts at 48 watt hours and 4,400 milliampere hours. And let's go on to the power cord, which in this case has three outlets, as we are used to, and the power brick. Pretty much the same, or it is exactly the same as on the Samsung N150 and all the other Samsung netbooks that are available right now. So it's got 19 volts and 40 watts, I think. And let's take a look at the device itself now. Always bumped and wrapped. Nice. That looks quite different from the M150, no glossy, but it's got like those, it's got a structure on the, on the lid and on the bottom too, so it's all mate all over the place and it's got this nice, feels pretty good, finish with those lines all over the place. All right, let's take a quick look inside. And as you can tell, it's all mate from the inside. There's only a small border around the screen that's a bit glossy. Should be all right though. And the rest of the finish looks pretty much the same as on the M150. You have exactly the same keyboard, at least looks like it. There's a webcam up there, the LEDs down here, and we have a nice border on the keypad, uh, on the trackpad and one single mouse button it should be all right let's take a quick look around we have the power plug ethernet port air bands a usb port microphone in and headphone out on the front there's the sd card reader right here and the power switch is up here and on the other side, there's something right here that I don't know which what that is. Please tell me in the comments if you know. Two USB ports, VGA out, and a CanSync lock. On the bottom, there's not much to see there. It looks like there's a SIM card slot prepared, but it's not. There's not an opening up here, so you can't slide in a card actually. And there's access to the memory down here and no way to access the hard drive, at least not easily without actually opening the whole device. All right, let's plug in the battery. Fits flush, nice and easy. As you can see, it's all pretty flat, stays thin. The battery just looks out or bumps up, bumps the device up a bit, but I guess that's all right. All right, 
So that was our unboxing of the Samsung NB30. I'm Roland from netbooknews.com and DE, and see you next time.